ました。For close to three decades at 565 Dundas Street, you will find hair power in the heart of Woodstock. A family-owned salon that was brought to the city by current owner Frank Camiso's father Giuseppe, who had a vision to cut style and provide chemical services to residents living in the community. Hair power has the unique distinction of being the first eco-friendly sustainable salon in Oxford County. Just last year, they partnered with Green Circle Salons, a company that recycles industry waste to divert everyday products from entering the landfill and waterways. With the assistance from the Green Cycle program, Hair Power has been able to not only recycle, but repurpose certain items from their salon. Hair clippings are being kept out of landfills, which are preventing the emissions of harmful methane gases to be released into the atmosphere. The clippings are also transformed into brooms, and the aluminum foil will be repurposed into bicycles. Hair Power has accepted that partnering with this program comes at an extra cost to the business, but knows it is well worth keeping our planet clean for us and generations to come. When County Council committed to 100% renewable energy by 2050, they were the first municipal council in Ontario to do so. Oxford County has been recognized internationally, nationally, provincially, and locally for its leadership in the necessary transformation from fossil fuel dependency. With that leadership, Oxford County is further demonstrating that it's economical and viable to build to higher energy efficiency standards. Some of the initiatives we've implemented include affordable housing units in partnership with the nonprofit sector constructed to passive house standards, the waste management and education center constructed to net zero energy standards, net metering and solar energy projects at the Oxford County Waste Management Facility, Woodstock Wastewater Treatment Facilities, and all three Winniford Lodge locations. And as part of the county's Green Fleet Plan, implemented 31 alternative fuel vehicles, including Canada's first hybrid ambulance and compressed natural gas powered snowplows. The future Oxford Community Sustainability Plan creates a vision of a sustainable community that balances community, environmental and economic interests. As part of this network, the county is a member of Smart Energy Oxford, an action team uh, that is a coalition of municipalities, sustainable energy businesses, local distribution companies, sustainable energy advocates, and of course, private citizens who are all committed to cultivating a culture of a 100% renewable energy right here in Oxford County. One of their activities, community-wide, is a speaker series that hosted with the uh, Oxford County Libraries, and it has showcased a bunch of sustainability pr practitioners right here in Oxford. Things like State of the Hydrogen Industry, the Woodstock General Hospital's journey to sustainability, electric vehicle drop-in sessions, and net zero. What does it all mean? And what can I do to reduce my energy consumption at home? Hello, my name is Perry Lang, President and CEO of the Woodstock Hospital. We are honored to have been nominated for the Energy Conservation Innovation Award. I would like to thank those who have recognized our effort in environmental stewardship. Environmental stewardship has been embedded into the design and operation of the new Woodstock Hospital. Hi, my name is Chris Marion and I'm the Director of Capital Projects at Woodstock Hospital. And I'm also the Chair of the Environmental Advisory Committee. Our hospital's efforts in terms of energy conservation and innovation include the installation of 340 solar panels. This makes up approximately 50% of the power for our medical professional building. This project includes roof-mounted panels as well as spatium-mounted panels. This allows the solar panels to be integrated as an architectural feature and also as a way to promote solar energy to our community. We've also installed 21 electric car charging stations in three different locations on the hospital property, as well as educational signage. We felt this was an important initiative in supporting a movement towards electrical vehicles within the public and among our staff. Woodstock Hospital has also installed a combined heat and power plant that allows us to use natural gas to produce electricity for the hospital. We also use the heat from the combined heat and power plant to heat the hospital. In total, this combined heat and power plant produces 85% of 
of the total hospital electricity load. The Woodstock Hospital has been recognized nationally for our environmental stewardship. However, recognition from our community partners is most rewarding. The Woodstock Hospital is committed to continually improving the environmental performance of our hospital and promoting the importance of environmental stewardship with our 1,200 staff members. We are honored to be recognized for our efforts with this nomination and wish all the best to the other nominees. Thank you.